Hey everyone! In today's video, I am using the Kylie Holiday Edition palette, which is so beautiful, guys. I'm in love. This is the first palette I've bought from her. First product, actually. This is the first product I've bought from her, and I can honestly say I am impressed. So if you guys have been wanting to get this palette, I definitely recommend it. It's so beautiful, the colors are super pigmented and they blend well. I was also going to do three looks today, however I did not have enough time. So I will be doing the third look tomorrow and hopefully it'll be up tomorrow. And my background looks a little funky because it's just paper. My silver background got ruined, but whatever. So I'm working on getting a new background, but this will do for now. So yeah, if you guys want to see how I did the two looks, then just go ahead and keep watching. If you liked it, let me know, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in my next one. Okay, so I'm going to start off with my Urban Decay Potion Primer. I'm going to apply that all over my lid, blah blah blah. For this first look, I'm going to do my entire face. And for the other look, it's going to be the same. I'm just going to wipe off my eyeshadow and do it again. To start off this look, I'm going to set the potion primer with sugar cookie. This is the first palette I own of Kylie. This is the only product I own of hers. I honestly thought it was going to be bigger. It's like really tiny. It's like not even the size of my hand. However, the colors are very pigmented and easy to blend, so I guess that makes up for it being so small. So for my crease, I'm going to use Chestnut. I'm getting really confused with the names back here. I don't know if it goes in this order or that order. Whatever. I'm honestly so happy I ended up buying the one with the mirror in it. I really wanted the burgundy palette, but I had bought the Modern Renaissance, and I felt like the colors were very similar, so... I just stick with the modern renaissance. Now I'm going to go in with Silent Night and I'm going to place that under the chestnut. I'm so happy she's opening up a store in the Topanga Mall because I live fairly close to that, like an hour away. So going in with a pencil brush, I'm going to darken up Silent Night just a bit more. Boom, bitch. Going in with my LA Girl Pro Concealer, I'm going to start creating my crease. I tend to not breathe when I'm creating my cut crease, which is pretty bad. Oh, that like went in my eye. Didn't hurt though. Just like skimmed through my eye. Okay, going back in with that pencil brush, I'm going to blend out the concealer in the end right here. So I'm going to go with gingerbread and place that all over my lid. I'm not sure why this one looks a little more blue than this one, if I did everything the same. So I'm just going to clean up the edges. So now I'm going to go in with my Wet n Wild Mega Liquid Liner and just create my wing. I still don't know why this one is a lot bluer than this one. Maybe I did something... I don't know. Whatever. Okay, so now I'm going to take my Ardell Lashes in 105. I lost the little box, so... Yeah. Are those her eyes? I mean, that's a pretty stupid question. It's most likely, yeah, but are they? Probably, huh? So now moving on to my face, I'm going to be using my L'Oreal Pro Glow Foundation. For my concealer, I'm going to take the Too Faced Born This Way Concealer. For my setting powder, I'm going to use the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. Boy, 
What are you doing? Me. Baking. Boy. I love a girl I can bake. What are you baking? So I'm gonna apply some mascara onto my falsies now that they probably dried up. So I'm gonna dust off the translucent powder, but instead of just like letting it all fly away, I'm going to move it towards my cheeks just so I won't waste any. So to bronze up my face, I'm going to use the Too Faced Milk Chocolate Bronzer. And to contour my face, I'm going to use the Hula by Benefit. So I'm just going to clean it up with the Laura Mercier. For my highlight, I'm going to be using the Becca Highlighter in Pearl. For my lips, I'm going to be using Kylie's Malibu. Oh, it smells so good. I just want to eat it. So I'm going to apply a mascara to my bottom lashes. I'm going to start dusting this off. Okay, so that is all for the first look. And here's the second one. For the second look, I already primed my eyes. So I'm going to go in with Chestnut. Then taking Evergreen, I'm going to put that all over my lid and blend it in with Chestnut. So I'm going to sharpen up this corner right here. I'm going to take the shade Frosty and place that in my inner corner. I'm going to create my wing with my Wet n Wild Mega Liquid Liner. I was having some technical difficulties with my lashes, but these are the Sumptuous Beauty Lashes that got sent to me. And they're so gorgeous, guys. They're easy to apply and they are comfortable. And they're fucking awesome. They're super beautiful. So that concludes both looks. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one.